Hello everybody and welcome back to DBS Games, I'm AU2K416 and we're going to be changing it up a little bit for all of you awesome people out there watching our video right now. Hopefully you guys are also going to enjoy the gameplay, it's Modern Warfare 3, first game back, it was very interesting especially uh, how the game works now because it seems different compared to all the other CODs like Black Ops, Black Ops 2, Ghosts and all. But I want to talk to you guys a little bit more personally. Now the reason why we didn't upload for a whole week and a bit was because my brother and I went on to a camp. Now I'm going to be telling, well I'm going to be telling you the story of our camp that went for seven days long. Now the camp was fun, it was very unnoticed, um, it was last minute, basically uh, our parents friends came along, said hi and asked do you guys want to camp? So they said yeah but we can't right now so she said hmm what about the kids? So then my parents obviously said why don't you just go ahead have some fun out in the sun which of course we don't necessarily mind the sun we just don't um, like to go out all the time because we have more important things to do gaming <laughs> um, but no we are sporty uh, don't forget about that we're still thinking about showing these guys pictures of us at least so that you at least know something about us besides from our voice or my voice only of course um, so yeah it was a three hour trip to the camp um, I drove an hour and a half for the, uh, for the rest of it it was basically a straight drive with a couple of curves going 100 kilometers an hour which is freaky it was awesome at the same time because you never knew what was going to happen and it was just chill but anyways oh my god well then now I'm back uh, sorry about that phone call I can't necessarily remember where the hell I was at the moment but I'll just say that uh, when we were at the camp it was a very cruel four days um, because it was it took a long time for us to get used to the very very bad um, beds I guess uh, I can't remember what you call them I always call them trenches for some reason but it's something else of a T I can't remember what it is um, but the view was awesome I've got a couple of pictures I probably won't show with these guys but I haven't showed to anyone else either so I guess that's fine um, for one, it was hot. There were bees, there were flies, there were mosquitoes on the last day, but in the first four days, bees, flies, and I think it was like crickets or some shit like that. They were making very funny noises. Um, each day began to become better, but also worse at the same time because um, we were there with another family and my parents weren't there with us until the last two days and in the end only one parent came which is quite sad but you know you can't do too much about that it doesn't really matter too much to me uh, anyways I didn't want to really stay there for much longer because the other family's kids were, were two, five and seven and their oldest, which is my age, 17, didn't go, uh, didn't go, so I was very disappointed, you know, I was actually expecting at least another mate over there, so that we can just, like, screw around, do whatever, uh, because when you're with your brother and little kids, it does not go down well with me all the time, especially when they cry and cry and cry. But yeah, that, I guess you guys should understand my predicament there. So that went on for four days long. Thank God. Well, I'll stop at that. 
on the third day my brother left because he got severely sunburned which I laughed about so much mainly because we needed him also to go and check out our YouTube we needed to be sure what was happening what everything was going to do Matt our newest member um, Vitality HD made a video for us which was awesome I liked the commentary not the best gameplay but you know it doesn't matter as long as the commentary is the best which it was um, so now there the last three days um, were interesting because another family came down on another campsite that was literally just 200 meters away from us and they shared the same beach with us so we were like oh yeah yeah it's cool cool um, um, second uh, second last day my dad came back uh, my dad, my brother, and someone else came. And basically what happened was we had a lot of fun until they came. Because um, there were two really, really good looking girls, sadly aged 14. So my brother was lucky, he's 15, I, I'm 17, so that's a three year difference. So all I, all I was doing was talking to the girls and the guy that was really, really badly leeching off of them. Uh, he could not stay away from, from them for a second and that's going to be my, my next commentary for you guys. So this is my first, this is, uh, and I'm going to have my second soon. Luckily this one gameplay that I'm using is very long so I'm, I've gone for 7 minutes long but probably going to have to cut 1 minute off because of the stupid phone. Um, but, yeah, in the end, this kid, he kept on annoying me on the last, uh, second last day and the last day because he was acting, acting like the biggest douche and you only see that when the, when the guy actually likes the girl and I've been there, I swear to god, I've been there, I'm gonna tell you all about it. Make sure you guys don't learn. Uh, make sure you don't. Blah, 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 blah. There we go. Make sure you guys don't do the same mistake as myself. I failed so hard there. Um, and I guess it's just learning tips for you guys to not do in your life because honestly, you'll end up regretting it. For instance, I regret four years of my life on this earth because I wasted four years. On one person only who didn't like me which I will give you guys an, a nice big bloated story which is gonna make you guys probably hate me <laughs> but you know if you guys enjoy these commentaries please hit that like button comment uh, comment what you guys like about it if you want more please do comment and subscribe if you really want to I'll be awesome though um, going on so my brother came back and he started chatting up the blondie. I had the, well, I was chatting up both girls, but I couldn't really chat them up to the point of, you know, going out with them or anything because they live in bloody, they live two hours away from us, which is bloody too far, and that's by car, so it's like three or four hours for transportation on like the public bus and train. Um, so that was pretty gay to find out, but. It's all right, I guess. We don't really, we don't really necessarily care. There's a lot of hot girls all over the place, but that was basically our camp. Shit in the beginning, finally became good, became even better, and then the kid that was leeching off of the girls was so pissed off with me that he sh he tried to um, threaten me. Well, he did threaten me, and then I threatened him back, and he kind of, like, shat bricks, cried, and then ran off. Well, swam off, I mean, because we were in the ocean, and he did that. And I was on a kayak, and I had a paddle in my hand. I was going to say, I'm going to go into the army, but that's another story. I'm not going to go into that. Um, then we came back home the next day, which was good. And then I made the shout out video and you guys should go check that gameplay out as well. That's pretty, I think that was a pretty awesome gameplay. It was 15 and 1, SNR, Clan Wars, with my Rift buddies. Um, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this gameplay. Please hit that like button, comment, rate, subscribe. I know I've said it again, but peace the hell out.
Thank you.